Nkwetjo. Le président, veuillez vous asseoir. ອົງຈຸນຍົກແລະປະກາດລະຕໍກໍຈໍານາການນິຕິວິທີສັນນາກາໃຫ້ສັນນາການໃນປຶກນີ້ໂດຍໄວ້ໄດ້ອົງຈ
and if they report and they recommendation by the two treating doctors that he that Mr. Yensari can participate si les in sont in the very near future Yensari peut participer then as scheduled the chamber will Dans hear the testimony proche, of the expert nous pourrons however on the contrary if the recommendation is of a si, negative contre, nature the recommendation the chamber will decide accordingly based on the recommendation of the treating doctor and the chamber will then hear the testimonies of other witnesses or experts whom Mr. Yensari has waived his direct presence. As for the, the second hearing, La the chamber will hear the opinions and the Ça oral submissions of various parties regarding the hearing of the testimony of the expert Philippe Schott. How the hearing and when the hearing shall be conducted, taking into account the condition of the health issue of Mr. Insari. As schedule, it was planned, he was planned to be heard Il était prévu à l'origine que l'expert from the vienne. from the first to the eighth of October, as indicated in document E one seventy two slash twenty four. The expert also informed the chamber that he could not make any other alternative appearance within this year. And as disponible à d'autres dates cette année. And for that reason, the chamber will hear the views of other parties with respect to the right of the accused. The chamber is of the view that if Mr. Insari cannot participate la in the hearing of the testimony si of the expert, his defense team will be allowed to question the witness through a, an, a remote means if there is a request a from his defense team. Si la défense en that is soin. the intention of today's proceeding. Ms. Sakovati, could you report the attendance of the parties Madame and individuals to today's proceeding? Pour les audiences d'aujourd'hui. Second, would the Mr. President of parties to the proceeding uh, present accept the accused Yensari, Yensari, who is absent due to Yensari his health? Pour des de santé. The accused Yensari and Nunti and Kiu Sampon have their presence through their counsel in today's proceeding. The letters or waivers from the true accused have been submitted Les to the greffier. The true treating doctors who have been summoned by the chamber to testify today are present and ready to be called by the chamber. The true doctors confirmed to their best knowledge they have no relation by blood or by law to any to the accused in Sari or any of the civil parties who have been recognized by the chamber in this case. The two doctors already took an oath this morning. Thank you. President, thank you. President. Merci beaucoup. Before we invite the doctors into the courtroom, the chamber would like to inquire with Insari's defense la regarding the proceeding de for the first hearing. De la part de la de this is to discuss the health condition of Mr. Yingsari sur le sujet de l'audience d'aujourd'hui. Ton... Uh, good morning, Mr. President. Good morning, Your Honor. Good, good morning to everyone Bonjour in and around the courtroom. We've discussed this matter with Mr. Inksari. Obviously, he has no problem uh, uh, and waives any rights uh, as far as his medical condition being discussed openly and uh, transparently before the public. Uh, we are prepared to question the doctors ourselves. Uh, so we can either proceed 
first or the trial chamber which is, is, si has, has done in the past comme il a fait dans le passé. Um, proceed by asking the general questions and then allowing the party to, uh, to follow up uh, that, that, that suits us as well. We believe that we should be going after the trial chamber and before the, uh, the prosecution, giving the prosecution the last word uh, or the opportunity to, uh, to clear up any matters that they may feel have not been satisfactorily covered. Uh, through the question by the judges or the de defense. So I'm at your disposal. I can go first, pertinent. or you can Donc, go. Je your Honor, can, uh, can go first. Either way, I'm good to go. I'm good to go. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. President, thank you, Council. The Merci. question to you is that this hearing is related to the personal health status of your client. And the question is whether the hearing can be conducted in public. Client. Do you have any objections to that? Absolutely not. In fact, uh, we did indicate to the senior legal officer uh, that we wish to have this in public hearing because we do believe that the public should be aware of of what is going on, and we have discussed this with Ms. Yingsari. We Nous have his full confidence in and uh, his authority to go forward in a public forum. Il nous a permis de so the answer is yes. Que cette audience se tienne en public. Donc la réponse, Monsieur le Président, est oui. Thank you. That is clear. Le Président, je vous remercie. C'est très clair. Upon hearing the response from Mr. Insari's defense team, Après avoir entendu la the chamber will proceed with the hearing of the testimony of the two treating doctors va tenir of Insari at the hospital. Qui and the chamber decides to hold this hearing in public. Cette audience sera public. I Before the chamber invites the doctors into the court room, we would like to inform the parties and the public that the hearing of the testimonies of the two doctors from the Khmer Soviet Friendship Hospital are of the nature that they are considered witnesses, not experts. Court officer, could you invite the doctors in? Médecins déposent en qualité de témoins et non pas d'experts. President, good morning, Le doctors. Président. Bonjour. This morning, you are invited by the chamber to provide your Vous opinions in regards to the health condition of the accused Ian Sari, who had been hospitalized 
for a number of days. At the Khmer Soviet Friendship Hospital, he was hospitalized since Friday, the 7th of September 2012, and he is still being treated. However, in light of the necessity of the proceedings before the chamber, we will try to find the best solution for the proceedings to move forward as scheduled. And we will take into account our scheduling and the health condition of Ian Sari and whether he is able to participate in the proceedings. And before we start questioning you, we would like to inform you that before you respond to the questions put to you by the bench or any Avant other parties, please wait till you see the red light on the tip of the microphone and the console. Micro et sur la console. When the red light is on, it means the microphone Lorsque is operational lue, and uh, you can respond. Please leave a small gap between question and other session so that the interpreter is able to interpret your response. The questions put to you will be related to either one of the two of you. Les questions and any of you can uh, respond to the question put to you as deemed appropriate based on your experience. All you can assist one another if you think a response is incomplete or if you wish to add additional information so that the information is clear and complete. De cette façon, la chambre aura droit à des réponses euh, claires et complètes. Before we delve into the substance of the report, dans we le would like to ask some preliminary sujet, background information questions. from both of you. That is the judicial procedure practice at this court. Sur vos antécédents, il s'agit en effet de la pratique. Non. Ce Mr. Lum Sibuta. Dr. Lung Sibuta. My name is Lum Sibuta. Lum response. La réponse. Je m'appelle Lum Sibuta. Thank you. Question. Dr. Lum Sibuta. Le président. Merci. The chamber noticed that we already asked your personal information and your qualification on the 23rd of May 2012, is that correct? Response, yes, that is correct. Question. If that is correct, then there is nothing else to add to the transcript dated 23rd May 2012 regarding your personal background and qualifications. The next question to you is the following. Since then, have you changed your status or position within the Khmer Soviet Friendship Hospital? Response. Since then, there is no change to my employment. Thank you. As reported by the Grafier, you have no relation by blood or by law to the accused in Sari or any of the civil parties in this case. Is this information accurate? That's exact. Response. Yes, that is correct. Response. Oui. Thank you. Also, in the same report, you already took an oath. Is that correct? Response. Yes, that is correct. Oui. 
Thank you. We would like now to ask some background information uh, from Dr. Ki Bu Su. Doctor, Please is your Mr. name Ki Bu Su? Vous appelez-vous Ki Bu Su? Response. Yes, Réponse. that is correct. Oui. Question, Doctor, can you tell the chamber your date of birth? Doctor, pouvez-vous nous indiquer votre date de naissance? Response. I was born. Réponse. On the 15 of January 1955 in Chibampo Sap District, Kandal Province. Thank you. Question. Where is your current address? Response. I live at number 60, Street 51, Saint May Street, Quarter, Don Pen District, Phnom Penh. Thank you. As reported by the graduate, you have no relation with the accused Yang Sari or any of the civil parties recognized in this case. Is that correct? Yes, exact. Response. Yes, that is correct. Yes, that is correct. Question. Also, in the same report, it stated Question. that you already took an oath before you entered this courtroom. Is that correct? Response. Yes, Réponse. that is correct. Oui, est exact. Question. Doctor, Question. can you inform the chamber Doctor, of your education and your qualifications sur in relation to your occupation? Académique, ainsi que sur Response. Vos activités professionnelles. Yes, I can do that. Réponse, oui, je peux le faire. Allow me to inform the chamber of my brief biography. Voici I received my doctoral degree in 1985 from the Faculty of Medicine. I then continued to study in my specialized medical doctor at Bokto and in 2000. 2001, en 2001, I studied at a in France. J'ai étudié dans une université française. Since I started my employment, depuis I worked que j'ai commencé à travailler, je l'ai fait dans le years. domaine médical et ce depuis 26 ans. Thank you. Le président. Question: Where Merci. is your Current place of employment and Où in which area? Actuellement, dans quel domaine de spécialisation travaillez-vous? I currently work at the Khmer Soviet Friendship Hospital, and de la I am a chief of the general admission section. Je suis a chef du service a member de of the governing board for the du examination of the health of the accused at the ECCC detention facility. Chargé Thank you. D'examiner l'état de santé des accusés des CETC. That is all for the preliminary questions. Merci. Voilà pour les questions of the true doctors. Let me go into the substance. Entrons dans le vif Dr. Lomsi Wouta, I'd like to ask questions regarding the report by the Khmer Soviet Friendship Hospital. De de that is uh, the report inclusive of the date from the 7th to the 19th of September 2012, which has been submitted to the trial chamber. Your report dated 19 September 2012, and in the case file, it bears the number E11-87-2. 
uh, one officer could you Bardot. hand the report to the two doctors and uh, protect it on the screen? Bien fait. Bien fait. Bien fait. Bien fait. Bien fait. Bien fait. President, Le Président, Ms. Sakovati, Madame Sakovati, could you prepare the document, -vous the remaining documents, that is any of the relevant restant. medical documents starting from the 7th September 2012, ready for the doctors to review, if there is any. Qui date? Doctor, du septembre, the du report septembre 2012 in your hand, is that the tard. actual report Doctor, by le the que vous savez my Soviet Friends Hospital that you made par and submitted to the trial chamber on the 19th of September 2012? Response, Réponse. yes, that is correct. Oui. Question. Is it you who actually Question. treated Mr. Yang Sari? Est-ce vous-même qui avez suivi Monsieur Yang Sari? After he was admitted Après at the Khmer Soviet Friendship Hospital starting from the 7th September 2012 and up to today? September 2012 et jusqu'à ce jour? Response. Réponse. Since he was admitted to Depuis the hospital, our hospital, medical group, including myself, notre équipe de médecins dont je fais partie, have treated him. A suivi Question. cette personne. And before he was Question. admitted to the hospital on the 7th Avant September 2012, le 7 septembre, had you ever examined 2012, and treated que vous the accused in Sari? Response. Réponse. Regarding the treatment of injury i myself and my team moi même et mon équipe started since it was handed nous over nous from the Kalmet hospital to the Khmer Soviet Friendship hospital a été and it has been almost one year à notre hôpital cela Thank you. remonte après d'un an can you tell Question. the chamber 
of the status of the health of Mr. Yang Sari. Qu'en est-il de l'état de santé actuel de Monsieur Yang Sari? When he was admitted to the hospital, de l'état dans lequel il était en arrivant à l'hôpital, since 7 September 2012, subsequent days during his hospitalization, et qu'en est-il de l'évolution de son état de santé durant son hospitalisation? Response. Réponse. Allow me to give your honor a brief medical Permettez-moi report de vous présenter brièvement as un to the reason médical. he was admitted to the emergency department on the 7 September 2012. The reason for his hospitalization is in relation to his malaise. C'était en raison that d'un état de fatigue. malaise. C'est-à-dire qu'il était fatigué and that he could not, uh, be allowed to stay at uh, this location so he had to be admitted for treatment ici. at the Khmer Soviet Transit Hospital. Allow me to remind you as well, Your Honor, regarding his ailleurs, conditions during his hospitalization. We observed that after he was admitted to the emergency section, the conditions Related, that is the general conditions related to his health général, was in regard to his high blood pressure, problèmes, his heartbeat, hypertension artérielle, and rythme cardiaque, in general, et de they générale, were the same as previously examined. Des symptômes déjà However, observés par le passé. After, a while after he Toutefois, was admitted, quelques temps après son arrivée à l'hôpital, nous avons constaté la présence d'un autre problème justifiant son maintien à l'hôpital. It is related to his ostronopono, which is Il that is the bone of his neck, problème d'ostéoporose au niveau des os du cou. That means insufficient blood drawing through his upper head, entrave l'arrivée and du that sang he would have limited la tête. motor movement. Et cela limite la capacité motrice. And this medical condition means because of the collarbone of the bone of his neck, which has a Pressure, the pressure on the blood vein, which draws insufficient blood sur les to his upper head, ce and that caused the limited movement in his limbs. The limited movement in his limbs. And during about of the ten days of his admittance mouvements. and treatment at the hospital, his heart condition is normal. There is no concern Après dix jours about his heart beat. On peut considérer But the main reason for his admittance. And remaining at the hospital is due la raison to essentielle de la nécessité de le maintenir à l'hôpital the strict c'est movement of his limb and the limited blood flow to his upper head et que l'arrivée du sang vers la partie supérieure de la tête Thank you, se trouve entravée le médecin le président merci docteur can you also inform the chamber of his heart condition ailleurs, at this il? moment de l'état de son cœur actuellement. Response. Réponse. In relation to his heart condition, Concernant sa cardiopathie, tell you of his previous conditions. J'aimerais vous rappeler he used to have a problem with his le passé. went through his heart and it was treated back then in 1993. Les he was also touché, il a été traité en 1992. Il a aussi été opéré et on lui a placé une And that was his previous condition. Et un pontage. And after those operations, après ces interventions chirurgicales, and his conditions which started back then until today, et jusqu'à ce jour, is regard to his the the right part of his heart that the valve could not close droite du cœur completely qui pose problème à savoir que la valve ne se ferme pas it complètement means that his heart condition Autrement dit, is not as normal as ordinary people and during the one year monitoring of normal. his heart condition sa cardiopathie était suivie durant un no an 
on a constaté qu'il n'y avait pas de changement significatif so far, the au niveau treatment du cœur. Jusqu'ici, le traitement normal. cardiologique There is no to his heart apporté permet de constater qu'il n'y a pas eu de dégradation ultérieure de son état. Doctor, can you also add uh, some additional information in addition to all the reports submitted to the chamber by the Khmer Soviet Hospital? Par l'hôpital de l'amitié Khmer Soviétique, est-ce que vous avez des éléments supplémentaires in à apporter? In particular, all those information Je pense en particulier from the 7 September 2012. Aux informations datant du 7 septembre 2012 et des jours suivants. It States Dans le about rapport, his fatigue, il est question d'un état dizziness, de fatigue, il est question d'étourdissement, et fatigue. il est indiqué que les moindres mouvements le fatiguaient. The question to you is that Ma question this est la symptom suivante. Quelle est la principale cause de ce symptôme de fatigue And The doctor who is here at the ECCC tell us that Le he cannot go CETC into nous fait a higher ground or goes up because he will have dizziness. Can you tell us the condition for this symptom? What is the main cause? Monter des escaliers car cela for such condition. provoquerait des étourdissements. Selon vous, quel est la principale raison de cette situation. In relation to his fatigue, réponse. It's a, it at a third level and the main cause is due to his weakening fatigue, heart. Elle est essentiellement liée This is is related to à l'affaiblissement de son cœur. Les étourdissements sont liés à différents so one is symptômes. Heart condition. And Il y a since he's part, been treated by us, sa cardiopathie, the condition cannot go back et depuis to que nous normal. le traitons, nous But constatons qu'on ne peut pas normaliser son état. Mais il y a stabilisation. And recently, the concern for him in regards to the dizziness, and as I also seek advice. From on a constaté un problème des vertiges et nous avons demandé à des neurologues d'effectuer une scanographie de la boîte crânienne on his et nous avons constaté for the blood flow limited or restriction to the le flux head. sanguin And as a recent, he dirigé vers la partie supérieure du crâne était limité. C'est la raison d'un certain so engourdissement conclude, dans ses membres. His fatigue is related en conclusion, to his heart sa fatigue est liée à sa cardiopathie. And recently, as we discovered, due to the pressure Récemment, nous avons constaté qu'une pression était exercée sur l'artère, ce qui limitait l'arrivée du sang bone. dans la boîte crânienne. Thank you, doctor. Another point. Le président. David Lai, your Merci, opinion. docteur. Il y a un autre point sur lequel your, la Chambre aimerait connaître votre avis, doctor, comme indiqué dans le rapport du médecin traitant, et dans d'autres rapports ECCC, du médecin des CETC, il dit que l'insérité Yang Sari ne peut pas suivre les audiences, même à distance, backache. à cause d'une lombalgie. Selon vous, quelles sont les causes de cette lombalgie lui permet, ne lui permettant pas de rester assis durant les audiences Response. Réponse. Réponse. After we received the documents, medical documents from Après que nous avons reçu les rapports médicaux de l'hôpital Calmet, nous avons constaté que les scanographies effectuées par cet hôpital révélaient 
que cette kind of stack and that limit his movement. était telle qu'il se sentait However, quelque peu bloqué the dans ses mouvements. Current issue at the moment, Toutefois, in regards to his lumbago, actuellement, concernant the cette lombalgie, that he cannot be discharged is related to his stiff neck bone, est lié and that cause that leads to this as well and cou, leads to the numb in his limbs. These are the des main causes related to his neck bone. Vertiges. Previously, the diagnostic was done only Auparavant, un for the avait lower été posé part, uniquement but concernant later la partie on the diagnostic was conducted on the upper part and it reveals the issues with this neck bone. Et on a ainsi décelé ce problème Thank you, doctor. au niveau des os du cou. Let me now look at the latest medical report. Le président. Yes, you have Passons treated au dernier him rapport médical en date. at the hospital since the 7 September 2012. Has his condition improved? If so, can you tell us if he is able to be discharged from the hospital? And if so, when can he be discharged? Et si oui, quand? Response. Since his first day of admittance on Réponse. 7 September 2012, son le through 2012, our observation and my personal observation, nous avons it observé, indicates that his heart condition, although it's not good, sa, but it's son, normal. L'état de son cœur so est certes pas bon, normally. mais normal. Autrement dit, son cœur fonctionne normalement. Ce qui l'empêche de quitter l'hôpital, comme je l'ai dit, c'est l'engourdissement de ses membres. And the limited blood flow to his brain or his et head. le manque de sang arrivant au cerveau et dans la boîte crânienne. According to the neurologist, d'après le main neurologue, cause for him or for his dizziness. And La principale the numbness cause in his limb de son engourdissement et de ses vertiges, blood flow due to the pressure on the blood vein at the de l'arrivée du sang à cause d'une pression exercée sur l'artère par les vertèbres cervicales. And we have tried to find other solutions Nous for the treatment envisagé d'autres options de traitement en consultant divers experts médicaux de l'hôpital. En effet, si on se fonde sur un traitement médical, cela prendra du temps. Et le succès du traitement sera limité. Par contre, si l'on opte pour une intervention chirurgicale, afin de faciliter We are trying to find whether it is possible, and according to the medical experts, we will face a number of critical challenges. Mais d'après les experts, cela One main issue is de gros his heart condition, as he cannot, as anesthesia cannot be used on him. Du coup, also, osteoporosis is another main cause, because for his bone, Osteoporosis is a main cause as well. These are two main challenges voilà to limit the de option for surgery. And une intervention during the last few days, I consulted with neurologists and surgeons to find other alternatives if we cannot pour le cas où operate on him and we continue the medical treatment impossible. as we are doing now, it's going to take uh, quite a long time. And we are trying to consult with temps. other expert, medical experts at the climate hospital to deal with the pressure of the neck bone on the blood flow. Examiner le problème de and la limitation de l'arrivée du sang. If surgery cannot be done, he's going to be hospitalized si for quite a long while at the hospital, at least another month. He will be staying at the hospital for at least one month. And if we try to fix 
the si issue of the pressure on the blood de trouver une solution uh, au problème de la pression exercée par les vertèbres cervicales sur l'artère, et si on essaie de trouver des solutions à l'ostéoporose, well. cela prendra aussi beaucoup de temps. So medical treatment is going to take a, a quite a while. It's going to take a, into months. Du temps. And it is difficult to say whether he can return to his uh, better condition. De prédire s'il est possible d'obtenir une amélioration de son état de santé. If we can dilate the blood si vein to release the pressure, it's going to be afin de réduire la good pression for him. exercée but the dessus. Challenge is ce sera une bonne chose. Mais il existe un risque. Il faut se demander si le patient peut résister à une intervention chirurgicale. Il s'agit du problème auquel nous nous attelons actuellement. Thank you, judges of the bench. Do you have any questions to be put to the doctor? Judge des questions à poser au médecin. Judge Cartwright, you may proceed. Je vous en prie. Thank you, President, and thank you to both of you for. Coming today, I know it uh, interferes seriously with your usual work, and uh, I am very grateful to you for assisting in this way. Uh, I'm also very grateful for the clarity of that uh, explanation, because sometimes we can't fully understand the medical reports that we receive. So I have just a few additional questions. Uh, first, um, you, you have made it very clear that his current heart condition uh, and um, his uh, issues with his um, back et que les remain de pretty stable, although they are uh, quite serious. Is, is that si a fair summary of what you have told us? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Clarify the uh, general condition of Mr. Inesiri following his admission to the ce, emergency section of the jour hospital. De son au des the de clinical assessments of his une évaluation coronary clinique system is de son that, of course, a été the uh, cardiovascular uh, system was stable, but this, by being stable in this uh, sense stable. is that uh, when he was admitted to the hospital Mais and until to date, uh, he depuis son was uh, stable, but I mean, in that sense, it means that uh, stable, uh, he uh, there was no substantial um, deterioration of the uh, condition, de son état. and we also sent uh, the result of the Nous avons uh, scanning for analysis, but in terms of the uh, fluctuation of the conditions, uh, it was uh, minimal. Fluctuations uh, de son état de santé, however, ces fluctuations étaient minimes. Uh, what uh, prevents us Toutefois, actually uh, from uh, saying that it was stable is that Ce because of the uh, problems with his uh, la stabilité de cervical and disc astral risk. Uh, that is the situation, uh, the new discovery that uh, led to the uh, problem with his uh, blood veins uh, circulation that uh, blood cannot be actually sent uh, to the uh, brain. But in terms of the heart condition, it Mais pour is stable. Ce qui there was no um, significant deterioration, de but de the coeur, uh, pertinent de problems we have uh, discovered is Le the uh, multi-stage uh, cervical ankyl-disc astrosis. Thank you. Um, and you have, to a large degree, answered my next question, which was that this, um, uh, this problem with the um, uh, insufficient blood flow to the head has been very recently discovered and could not have been discovered without doing a neurological examination, uh, including a scan. Is that the situation?
In relation to the blood circulation concernant la circulation sanguine et l'arrivée de sang dans le cerveau, nous en avons parlé avec In le neurologue. Une scanographie cérébrale and we a été effectuée. Also found, uh, the dis nous avons diffuse osteoporosis. constaté également la présence d'ostéoporose diffuse. Uh, cervical and co disc we had to probably conduct uh, operation that was one of the possibilities uh, even though uh, there was an adherent risk uh, of conducting this but uh, we so far consulted with many uh, specialists that that was one of the uh, possibilities and that was the pertinent problem concerning uh, this uh, cervical and co disc and so this and uh, it also uh, relates uh, to the uh, vertebrobacillar syndrome insufficiency. Thank you for that um, explanation. Um, um, the operation to which you refer, uear, uh, you've made it very clear that it is it carries risks that are higher than the usual risks of surgical intervention because of uh, the um, heart problems and probably as well as orthopedic problems. Ca can I inquire of you if um, such surgery uh, has been carried out on similar patients at Khmer Soviet Friendship Hospital, or is this the type of very highly specialized surgery that would require um, additional expertise to be um, to supplement the skills already uh, at your hospital qualifié en plus des médecins dont vous disposez actuellement this is the truth if we have to uh, undergo the surgical intervention, we bon have effet, to si uh, think of various options. We have to Il consult with neurologists and the analysts as well. In my personal uh, professional opinion, I do not recommend any surgical uh, operation at this time. It may uh, be uh, one of the options, but uh, taking into consideration his fragile state of health, uh, it poses a real risk uh, if the, uh, any surgical intervention is conducted. However, I am now seeking consultation with other specialists, neurologists, and uh, also in order to discuss this. And that is the main uh, challenges uh, facing us now. And as for the uh, specialization uh, of this uh, at our hospital, our specialist is on his overseas uh, uh, mission Les now, but we are uh, consulting with other uh, specialists as well. But as for the surgical intervention, uh, we have to uh, explore sujet, more options as to which one of which uh, way is uh, more feasible in, in this uh, uh, present uh, condition of the uh, patient. Thank you. Uh, I clearly understand Merci. that. Uh, uh, as you assess the situation at present, you would not be recommending surgery because of the associated risks. Can I um, ask you then, in the alternative, should you treat him uh, uh, with, uh, the, with your skills as a, as a physician, what sort of treatment would be involved in um, helping to improve the blood flow as you have described it. As for the uh, treatment, 
Mr. Yung Sari is still in the uh, emergency section of Yung the hospital. And as for his uh, lumbago, uh, he was being treated by a, a different specialist. And he has uh, provided uh, his observation to his condition. Uh, and he also uh, prescribes a certain medicine as well in order to um, ensure the uh, stability of uh, his uh, condition and that can to a certain extent um, ensure this uh, stability and I have to consult the neurologist as well in order to come up with the assessment in terms of his neurology problem and so far we have uh, uh, examine him uh, on a regular basis in the uh, intensive care uh, section and we also discuss with a French uh, specialist who is on a consultation um, mission at our hospital and he also recommends that the use of medicine has a minimal uh, positive impacts on his condition uh, operation uh, will be the uh, uh, likely possibility uh, but once again as I said uh, taking into account his fragile state of health uh, surgical intervention is uh, very risky. I have to consult with the specialists at Calumet Hospital and other uh, specialists uh, to get their opinion, medical opinion, in relation to uh, the alternative way forward. Uh, thank you very much. Uh, just one final matter. Um, there were some medical experts uh, called by the court uh, in relation to Yang Tirat, who were also asked to examine uh, Yang Sari and provided the chamber with a report dated the 3rd of September, which made certain recommendations um, concerning uh, medication and um, uh, changes to the practical arrangements such as beds, chairs, and so on. Have you had an opportunity of reading that report? As for the uh, m that medical report, uh, yes, I I read it, en effet, lu ce and uh, that is what uh, being applied uh, to him as well. And as for the uh, his nous uh, dans le arrangement uh, for his uh, stay at the hospital, for example, uh, the provision of chairs and and beds or so, uh, we actually uh, provided him these uh, facilities as well. But once again, in relation to his uh, cervical. Uh, and called disc asuris, which was uh, just discovered, it is uh, a new discovery, and uh, we uh, have not uh, provided any um, particular uh, solution, uh, medical solution uh, to this uh, problem. So we are trying now to find uh, a remedy for this uh, new discovered. Uh, this is, and we will explore whether or no medication is appropriate, or we have to explore uh, other alternatives. As I said, we have to consult with neurologists and other specialists as well to come up with any uh, remedy recommendation. Uh, thank you. I, I fully understand that the report from the experts was prepared before um, the um, diagnosis of the limited blood flow to the head was uh, diagnosed. I simply wanted to make sure that you had all the available information. Uh, and of course, the experts, when they examined Mr. Yang Sari, were not aware of this most recent um, diagnosis that you have explained today. Um, and uh, I didn't consider that anything in that report would, in the experts report, would have made any difference given the new diagnosis that you have just explained to us today. Um, so thank you very much for the clear manner in which you have explained uh, the current issue. 
um, and um, uh, I, I think in summary it would uh, you are saying to the court that uh, uh, surgical intervention is high risk uh, and would um, and I'm assuming that um, a, a, that it, a it would be successful, but he would still need a considerable period to recover from surgery. Uh, by the same token, uh, medical uh, intervention such as you are following now is also going to take a long time. So whichever option is finally selected, uh, Yeng Sari will not be well enough um, in your opinion, uh, to return to participate in the trial uh, from the holding cells or from the courtroom for some time. Is that a fair summary? Of his uh, condition, uh, it is as what you have just uh, described, and oui. I do not expect that, at least in the uh, short, uh, nous, nous uh, in, pas a in a short uh, term, uh, he will not uh, be able to uh, attend uh, the proceedings uh, himself because he uh, has. Uh, uh, problems in moving his neck, and uh, uh, that situation will exacerbate uh, if he has to move a lot, for example, if he has to come up and down, and so he has to be kept under observation in provisional intensive care uh, unit. I think that he should remain in this uh, intensive care uh, for at least uh, uh, some times more, but I am going to consult with other specialists as well in order to find other alternatives to ensure that he can uh, be returned to the detention facility of the court as uh, soon as possible, so we will try to explore uh, the feasible options uh, to uh, ensure that uh, he will receive uh, a better uh, treatment for his current condition. And uh, thank you very much uh, to both of you. Uh, President, I have no further questions at this point. The President, thank you. I now hand over to the prosecution uh, if you have any questions. But oh, now, uh, my colleague, uh, Judge Levin, you may proceed. Oui, merci, Monsieur le Président. Just two questions to precise answers. Tout d'abord, ce concerne la cardiopathie dont vous avez fait état. Vous avez indiqué qu'elle était sérieuse, qu'elle était grave, mais qu'elle était stabilisée. Ce que je souhaiterais savoir, c'est si vous considérez qu'il y a eu une détérioration de l'état de, de santé de M. Yang Sari par rapport à cette pathologie. Et je voudrais notamment attirer votre attention sur le fait que dans le rapport que nous avons reçu de l'hôpital de l'amitié kmiro soviétique en date du 19 septembre, il est notamment indiqué que euh, M. Yang Sari présente une dyspnée de niveau NYHA3. Donc, est-ce que vous pourrez, pourriez expliquer ce que veut dire une dyspnée de niveau NYHA3 et est-ce que euh, cette constatation euh, va plutôt dans le sens d'une détérioration également de cette pathologie cardiaque in relation to his uh, cardiovascular condition, Donc, if you look at uh, the results uh, of our ex clinical examination, I uh, can respond to the uh, question that uh, if we compare the clinical assessment of his uh, cardiovascular uh, condition based on the uh, ECG, we did not observe uh, any significant uh, 
involvement that is uh, noticeable. But of course, uh, he has uh, suffered from a lot of uh, cardiovascular complications uh, so far. And what uh, is now uh, pertinent is that the situation might uh, be uh, degenerative uh, because uh, of his uh, advancing age as well. And now, as you, I mentioned in this report, that this near class uh, Niha 3 is, uh, is a pertinent issue with his advanced cardiovascular uh, disease. If we uh, compare with the last six months report, uh, because uh, cardiovascular functions uh, did not uh, uh, degenerate, I can say that it is uh, rather uh, stable, and that, that is uh, not uh, something uh, we are very concerned about. The, uh, the, the main concerns that is uh, that is the uh, cervical and cold that we have just diagnosed. Just to be une, absolutely sure, une dyspnée de niveau 3 correspond à un état où uh, le patient a un essoufflement means that um, the patient suffers from short of breath, et un essoufflement, of breath même lorsque le patient est, est au repos, et, even when the patient ou alors est-ce qu'il a un essoufflement à partir du moment où il fait un effort rest, minime Or does the patient suffer from shortness of breath at the slightest, uh, most minimal exertion Explanation of uh, this uh, cardiovascular, particularly people who suffer from Dashina class Niha 3, uh, is someone who has problems uh, with moving around. Uh, he will uh, be fatigued uh, when he moves around. Even making a slight movement, he would uh, uh, feel exhausted immediately. And this situation actually uh, was uh, prevalent uh, in this uh, patient for a long time. Uh, and the situation remained uh, stabilized over there. Uh, but as I said, we diagnosed in addition to his uh, current uh, disease is another uh, disease of concern, which is uh, cervical and co-disc cervical. Alors, juste une dernière question par rapport à, à ce nouveau problème et, et à l'option éventuellement d'une intervention chirurgicale. Vous avez dit qu'elle présentait une intervention qui présentait de, 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 des risques importants. Est-ce que là aussi, pour être sûr d'être bien compris par tout le monde et pour que les choses soient bien claires, vous pourriez nous préciser quels sont les risques euh, qu'encourrait M. Yang Sari. Est-ce qu'on peut dire qu'il y a un risque d'infarctus, un risque d'accident vasculaire cérébral euh, ou un risque euh, de pulmonaire quelle est, quelle est la nature du risque en cours uh, if, uh, he undergoes a surgical uh, intervention. That is one of the options, of course, uh, and, we, uh, and that uh, is taken into account the recommendation from other specialists as well. We say that uh, in order to uh, dilate uh, the cervical uncoded disc, as cyst, one option is to uh, conduct surgical intervention, uh, but uh, taking into consideration his uh, heart disease uh, at the moment, uh, this uh, surgical intervention will involve a lot of complication. And in, in addition, we have to factor in uh, the fact that he is now very old, and he does not have any energy to uh, stand uh, this uh, 
operation and in addition he has to stand with the anesthetic uh, administration as well and whether or not uh, he will uh, stand uh, this anesthetic uh, administration and in addition he is also suffering from a diffuse oster osteoporosis. Uh, this is also a problem with him, and even if we can dilate uh, the uh, cervical anco disc as through cysts, we don't know whether or not there will be any other uh, side effects or implications uh, for other diseases. That's why, as I said uh, from the very beginning, this is one of the options. We will have to explore other options to find the best alternative uh, that has the minimal impact uh, on his uh, condition. Condition. Because we understand that his uh, cardiovascular uh, condition is very vulnerable at the moment, uh, so we have to take into consideration every uh, possible side effect of this operation if uh, he has to undergo it. Thank you very much, Doctor, for those clarifications. President, uh, thank you. So I now hand over to the prosecution. If you have any questions to put to the witnesses, you may proceed. Thank you, Mr. President. Uh, we do have a few questions. Um, Mr. Carnavas has requested to go first. Um, that, that is agreeable to us. If it's agreeable to the court, um, we, we would be um, uh, agreeable to following Mr. Carnivus if he wishes to, to, to question the uh, doctors first at, at your um, discretion. C'est bien sûr uh, à la discussion de la chambre. President. The chamber would like to give the floor now to Council Michael Canavans, the Defence Council for Insari. You may proceed. Thank you, Mr. President, and I um, wish to thank the uh, prosecution for allowing me to go at this point. Uh, I'll be very brief. Uh, doctor, uh, from what I understand, what you're telling us is Ce que je comprends, that Mr. Yingsari's brain is not getting sufficient oxygen. And that's what's causing his inability to have mobility and the dizziness. Sa mobilité et Do I have it right? Donne lieu à des étourdissements. Et j'ai bien compris. Regarding the Réponse. dizziness, as advised by the neurologist, yes, Le this somehow is interconnected. And that is in relation to the narrowing cervical canals. And regarding the numbness of his limb, as étroits. I was advised, if his cervical canal si narrows, that is the pressure put on coup, the blood vein, that caused the numbness in his limb. Plus étroit, cela a un effet sur les veines et ce qui and mène à des enfourdissements des membres. Dizziness, it's also related étourdissement. to his uh, hypertension Cela and his uh, heart condition. I also read a report by the uh, doctor who examined him. That condition is uh, slightly related, and his Il movement, that is from sitting to stand up, is uh, limited. Lève, but ou, mainly it deals with the his, uh, neural system. Il y a un effet sur le système right. neurologique. But let me go back because I'm just trying to simplify it so I can understand it right. There's a problem with the blood flowing to the brain. Il y a un problème de circulation sanguine au cerveau. And that's where everything else stems from. Et Do I have it right? Problème découle de cela. Ai-je bien compris? But réponse. Response. According to the opinion of the neurologist selon le neurologue his narrowing cervical canals les 
limit vaisseau the blood flow from the heart to his head. Trop étroit, cela limite However, la circulation sanguine à sa boîte crânienne. It is not an immediate risk at the present time, immédiat. but it may evolve in the future, which may cause a concern. Et ce pourrait devenir plus Thank you, and I'm going to go step Question. by step. I, I, I understood what you said. I just want to make sure that I simplify it enough so I can understand it. En langage assez simple, so pour que j'ai bien compris. There's an insufficient flow. Donc, of blood to the head, de la circulation sanguine can we conclude that the brain is getting an insufficient amount of oxygen for it to properly function? Pour bien fonctionner. Uh, Here we say that the blood flow is insufficient, it si is uh, not yet at that stage. En fait, ce pas but le cas. the symptom includes the restriction of blood flow through the head. Mais les, euh, the évaluations current montrent il status y a does not have any réduction de la circulation sanguine à la boîte crânienne. Cela n'a pas un impact and that is grave. the opinion of the neurologist. Là du neurologue. This is a symptom determined by the neurologist. neurologist. Qui a été par okay. Well, that is causing the dizziness, is it not? Question. Oui, mais cela cause des étourdissements. Uh, doctor, I would most appreciate it if you would doctor, give me the courtesy of listening as opposed to carrying on a conversation. M'écoutiez plutôt que de mener Please. une conversation avec votre voisin. So let me. That's my question again. Bon, j'aimerais poser ma question une fois de plus. Is the lack of blood flowing to his head Le causing de the dizziness? À la boîte crânienne and it's a yes la or cause no. De l'étourdissement, c'est oui ou non. Uh, uh, as Affecte-t-il sa capacité à se concentrer? Bah, je pourrais dire lien entre la concentration et les étourdissements, je ne peux me prononcer. Et dans il n'y a pas de neurologue Opinion médicale. The report made by the psychologist le rapport du psychologue on this patient it indicates that at the moment it does not have any psychological impact on him. Il a pas d'impact psychologique sur All right. Now you've been observing him for Question. some time. Vous l'examinez depuis un Let's talk about the last temps. 10 days. Parlons des 10 derniers jours, je vous prie. We've been in this courtroom now for approximately one hour and 25 minutes. Given what you've observed of Mr. Ng Siri, would he have been able to concentrate and answer questions such as the ones that you've been answering for such a period of time? Vous avez répondu pendant autant de temps. As for the yeah. concentration, Réponse. we cannot make our assessment whether he is able to concentrate. Our capacity is whether he is able to participate in the proceeding is Nous mainly to deal with his movement and his innate movement. En termes de sa participation, that is uh, my field of the assessment. De ses and when it comes to his uh, feeling of uh, psychological status, uh, there should be the opinion of the expert in that field. 
to me, I do not see any concern regarding this aspect, but of course I am not the expert in this area. All right, aspect, so you hear just to speak about the matière. physical aspects of Mr. Yingsari's condition. Yes, uh, that is correct, oui, because exact. I do not ha have any expertise to Car make assessment regarding his uh, mental status. Je pas les compétences pour évaluer son the état reason mental. that he cannot be discharged from the hospital, that he uh, cannot participate in the proceeding physically, that is my field. But when it comes to the, physique, medical, voilà, to the mental status, uh, that's outside of my expertise. Thank you. Now, if we go to the last page of your report, I notice that there are 17 types of drugs that you or your fellow doctors, your colleagues, are administering to Mr. Ingsari on a daily basis. Do you see that? Le voyez-vous? Do you see the Voyez-vous la liste? Yes, Réponse. I do. Oui. And of these 17 Question. different medications, Sur ces 17 how many of which are you directly administering to Mr. Ingsuri, prescribing, that is. Combien d'entre eux avez-vous prescrit personnellement? Response. The Réponse. medicines listed uh, on this page are that are being administered on him on a regular basis. And of course, it, it seems quite a lot. I also consulted with other fields. As for prostate, it is removed. But there's a few medicines to deal with his uh, cervical condition. And it is necessary for him to take uh, those en fait, medicines. Le, le cervical, il est nécessaire qu'il prenne and ces médicaments. of course, we give the medicines based on Et the opinions given to us by the experts in neurology. As for the business, the medicines that we administer to him is for a short term. If we don't see any improvement within three or four days, then we will stop administering those medicines. Of course, I understand, as you can see, due to his uh, advanced age and uh, a number of medicines to be administered, I consulted repeatedly with uh, my colleagues, and we only try to administer the necessity medi necessary medicines for him, and only those medicines Seul to stop dizziness would, be, would uh, not be administered, and it will be stopped today. Et les médicaments pour les uh, thank you, doctor. Let me ask my question again. Question. Merci, of these 17, can you just list the numbers of the ones that you are directly prescribing to Mr. Ingsari, so we know which ones you are not? Pour que sache lesquels vous n'avez pas prescrit. In general, they are the medicines that he has uh, taken regularly since he was transferred to our care. The new medicines upon consultation are those to, for the treatment and for his uh, dizziness uh, symptoms. Vise à traiter les symptômes de vertige. And the medicines that we add are three, that is one multivitamin that is Superdin and Probasterol. Ce sont des multivitamines, ainsi... Okay, so you're saying if I understand you, out of the 17, question, 14 of these drugs he was taking prior to being admitted, il y en avait 14 qui les prenait avant son admission à l'hôpital. Are we to understand that? Est-ce bien ainsi qu'il faut comprendre ce que vous dites? Uh, 
Je ne me souviens pas exactement, mais il s'agit de médicaments qu'il prenait auparavant. Et cela would include uh, codeine, for cela instance, inclut par exemple 16. la codéine, le numéro 16 dans la liste, n'est-ce pas Réponse. He has taken it for quite a, Il prend sometimes depuis now. un certain temps l'efféragant codéine. Ce médicament est un antidouleur. Nous essayons de réduire la dose administrée. Ce médicament lui est administré pour euh, atténuer ses douleurs. And he has taken these medicines For quite a Il while prend now. ce médicament depuis un certain temps. Now you told us that a scan was performed on him. Vous dites We know that he was admitted on September 7. Le 7 septembre. In the emergency. Can you please tell us when the scan was performed? À what day? La scanographie a-t-elle été effectuée? À quelle date? Je ne me souviens pas de la date exacte de la scanographie. Je pense que c'était le 11. Notre évaluation initiale était que le problème principal était lié au cœur, mais par la suite, nous avons constaté la stabilité de son état de santé cardiologique. Raison pour laquelle, le 11, nous avons procédé à une scanographie Question. C'était donc cinq jours après son arrivée au service d'urgence de votre hôpital. So my question is that was five days after that question he was admitted. De la is that what your records reflect? C'était donc cinq jours après son arrivée. Est-ce que cela correspond aux informations de votre dossier? Yes, it was five Réponse. days after. Effectivement, cinq And jours après. After we asked the experts to examine Nous avons him, demandé then à un we tried to find. Et nous avons envisagé d'autres pistes, raison pour laquelle nous avons décidé de procéder à une scanographie cervicale. Les scanographies précédentes portaient sur la colonne vertébrale, mais on n'a pas pu établir de lien avec la fatigue, le rebondissement et les vertiges. Les tests symptômes et après avoir fait le diagnostic, nous avons décidé de procéder à une première évaluation. Nous avons décidé de procéder à une première évaluation. Quand les consultants, les experts, comme les neurologues, quand ils ont été consultés, le neurologue, à quel moment ont-ils été consultés Les spécialistes. Ces spécialistes. Nous avons consulté le neurologue le 11 septembre au matin. En outre, au moment de l'arrivée du patient à l'hôpital, le 7, c'était pendant le week-end. 
either on Friday Je crois que c'était un vendredi ou un samedi. And while he was hospitalized at the hospital, then he showed Durant us that he indicated us that he, he felt the numbness in his nous a fait savoir que ses membres étaient engourdis. But when he first admitted the Mais symptoms was de son uh, his fatigue and les exhaustion, étaient so then they make assessment on his heart condition. C'est donc fondé and sur l'hypothèse de problème lié à sa cardiopathie. In the afternoon of Sunday, he felt the numbness in his limbs. Le dimanche après-midi, il a parlé d'engourdissement de ses membres, ce qui nous a conduit à consulter un neurologue. Because we did it a few days later, as the symptoms only were shown later on, not when he was hospitalized. Because we did it a few days later, as the symptoms only were shown later on, not when he was hospitalized. Because we did it a few days later, as the symptoms only were shown later on, not when he was hospitalized. Because we did it a few days later, as the symptoms only were shown later on, not when he was hospitalized. Because we did it a few days later, as the symptoms only were shown later on, not when he was hospitalized. Because we did it a few days later, as the symptoms only were shown later on, not when he was hospitalized. Because we did it a few days later, as the symptoms only were shown later on, not when he was hospitalized. Because we did it a few days later, as the symptoms only were shown later on, not when he was hospitalized. Because we did it a few days later, as the symptoms only were shown later on, not when he was hospitalized. Because we did it a few days later, as the symptoms only were shown later on, not when he was hospitalized. Because we did it a few days later, as the symptoms only were shown later on, not when he was hospitalized. Because we did it a few days later, as the symptoms only were shown later on, not when he was hospitalized. Que tout le monde But may I ask you, did you see him on Friday or Saturday vendredi, or Sunday? Samedi ou dimanche? Uh, Réponse. Response. For the um, emergency section in January. In in general, regardless whether it's a weekday or a weekend, we would examine a patient in that section twice a year. Because we know that the patient will be seen twice a year. Because we know that the patient will be seen twice a year. Because we know that the patient will be seen twice a year. Because we know that the patient will be seen twice a year. Because we know that the patient will be seen twice a year. Because we know that the patient will be seen twice a year. Because we know that the patient will be seen twice a year. Because we know that the patient will be seen twice a year. Because we know that the patient will be seen twice a year. Because we know that the patient will be seen twice a year. Because we know that the patient will be seen twice a year. Because we know that the patient will be seen twice a year. Because we know that the patient will be seen twice a year. Because we know that the patient will be seen twice a year. Because we know that the patient will be seen twice a year. Because we know that the patient will be seen twice a year. J'ai établi un rapport à l'intention du groupe de médecins traitants. Un rapport quotidien a en effet été établi. Nous essayons de trouver une solution. Parfois, certes, d'autres médecins le faisaient aussi, mais personnellement, je le voyais chaque jour. Question, est-ce que vous l'avez vu le vendredi 7 septembre lorsqu'il a été admis à l'hôpital Ou bien est-ce que vous ne l'avez vu que le lundi suivant Réponse. Le jour... De son Dr. arrivée à l'hôpital, le docteur Tom Hong l'a envoyé au service d'urgence. Ce jour-là, j'ai personnellement reçu le dossier du docteur Tom Hong, après quoi il est retourné au CECT. Je l'ai reçu personnellement. Now, Question. Après qu'il a été scanné, I take it, you being the primary physician overseeing him, along with the other team members, of course, you had an opportunity to speak with the neurologist and also look at the results of the scan. Is that right? Yes, exactly. 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 Issue, the technical issue for each section. For example, if a patient is admitted to my section, as in the case of Mr. Yisari, it is not I myself who make an assessment. I would read all the reports. I would examine him at least once a day and report to the technical group. À l'intention du groupe technique spécialiste et des spécialistes so concernés, afin de pouvoir tirer des conclusions communes. Au service d'urgence, il y a beaucoup d'allées et venues. The doctors stationed at the emergency section must Affecté au service d'urgence, doivent examiner chaque patient au moins une fois. Ensuite, un rapport est établi. Et si nécessaire, un autre médecin examine ce patient lorsque. 
qu'il y a Thank un changement you, the time is now appropriate for a de break. service, We will un changement d'équipe. Le Président, merci. Nous allons observer une pause de 20 minutes et reprendre à 11 heures. Officer, Monsieur d'audience, veuillez vous occuper des deux break. médecins pendant la pause and have them return to the et les ramener at dans 11. le prétoire pour 11 heures. Suspension de l'audience.